This video is about how to install PIP after the Python 3.11 install in a Debian or Ubuntu 22.04 machine. It demonstrates one way to install the PIP package installer for Python into Ubuntu with two versions of Python installed. So I'm going to try and install PIP with the Ensure PIP module. But Ubuntu complains about Ensure PIP with a warning message. Ensure PIP is disabled in Debian Ubuntu for the system Python. Python modules for the system Python are usually handled by Debian package and apt get. A typical command would be apt install Python 3 package. So we can't use Ensure PIP to install PIP for the system Python, but we can use this apt install Python 3 package to do it. So the PIP for Python 3.11 could be different than the system PIP. For Debian systems like Ubuntu, you will need the VNV module to use Ensure PIP. With the DeadSnakes PPA installed, you would use sudo apt install Python 3.11-VENV and then Python-M Ensure PIP to install PIP. Fairly simple. But here's the trick. Since there may be two versions of PIP on Ubuntu, a good way to clear up any confusion would be to use Python 3.11-M PIP when using PIP for the Python 3.11 version and Python 3-M PIP for the system Python. By always using Python version -m pip running pip as a Python module, it is explicit which Python version pip you are using. So don't just use pip because it could get confusing and you might get your system a little bit munged up. Outcomes, what you should be able to do after watching the video, install pip for Python 3.11. This is installed in your local home directory and to install pip for the system Python. This would be installed in the system Python directory. Requirements, an Ubuntu 22.04 computer. It's recommended that you back up your data and computer before doing this. This video install takes place on a fairly clean machine and is impossible to guess all the combinations out there. You're gonna need internet connection to install the VENV module. And you're going to need a Dead Snakes PPA personal package archive and Python 3.11 installed in Ubuntu. The next three slides contain additional sources of info, a list of the software used in making this video, and a disclaimer. If you wish, you can stop this video to read the next three slides. Here I am in Ubuntu 22.04, and Python 3.11 has been installed using the Dead Snakes PPA. I'm going to use the Ensure PIP module to install PIP. After that, I will demonstrate how to install an optional PIP install for the system Python. Before I can install PIP for Python 3.11, I will need to install the VENV module because of the way Python packages are arranged on Debian systems. So let's verify that Python 3.11 has been installed. 3.11 dash dash version. So it's there. So now I'm going to install the VENV module for Python 3.11. sudo apt install python 3.11 dash VENV. Hit enter. Password. Now, of course, this is coming from the Dead Snakes PPA. So now that it's installed, I can install pip. Do that, I do Python 3.11-m for module, ensure pip. And so now it's going to install it into the local user directory. And you'll see it says successfully installed pip 22.3.1. And that's all there is to it. Now one thing I would like to point out is on Debian systems up here, the disk utils package being used is actually from the system Python. 
And since Python 3 distutils 3.10.6 instead of the 3.11 package. But that's just uh, for Debian systems as far as my understanding goes. And that's how they work. Optionally, I'm going to install pip also for the system Python. And I'm going to try installing it using the ensure pip method. So first I have to install the vnv package again. So sudo apt install python3 dash venv. You'll notice I'm using python3, which is the system python, instead of python311. Hit enter. So if I go python3 dash m ensure pip. Ubuntu squawks a little bit. It gives you a warning. It says Python modules for the system Python are usually handled by Debian package and apt get. And you have to use apt install Python 3 module name. So that would be sudo apt install Python 3 dash pip is how you install the system Python pip. Go oh, yes. So now we have two pips installed. So to kind of check that out, I'll go Python 3 dash m pip dash dash version as 22.02 .02, and I will go Python 311 3.11-m pip version. So one thing I want to point out here is always a good idea to use that Python-m format before you start using pip because since you have two pips that's one way to keep them separated. It's probably the easiest way I would recommend or know how to keep them separated. So let's make sure that this works. I'm going to go Python 3 dash M pip install numpy. numpy. And this is going to install it in the local directory. So now that's installed in a local directory. And so let's go Python 3.11 dash m pip install numpy. And again installs it in the local directory. And let's take a look. New window. And well, I got to go to the local directory. Show hidden files dot local bin library. Well, you notice you got Python 3.10 and Python 3.11. Now for Ubuntu 22.04, Python 3.10 is the default or system Python. Open this up, site packages, and here we got our NumPy libraries. We go back to lib. And also in Python 3.11, open that up, site packages, and in here we've got pip. Now for the system pip, it's installed at USR lib instead of .local lib. And we've got a bunch of other things installed. But we have the NumPy here. Just want to point that out. Close that. So that's pretty much it for installing pip after installing Python 3.11 on Ubuntu 22.04. And it's really up to you if you want to install pip on the default or system Python also. Thank you for watching this. If you have any questions on this video, please ask them in the comments below. Also, if there is a video you would like to see made, please let me know. While I can't promise anything, I will try and look into it. Cheers.